Hi, I'm Miss Crafts a lot, and this is Get Your Craft On, yo. Today we're gonna do something slightly different. We're going to refurbish this tabletop. I bought this end table from a local antique store and decided I need to give it a little pep. For this project, you'll need a table that you want to refinish, Minwax Polycrylic, paintbrush, and scissors to cut your fabric with, and fabric. Before you begin, you should probably sand the tabletop so it's nice and smooth. I used a super fine grit just to make it nice and smooth, and obviously when you go to put the fabric on it, it's, these spots aren't going to show up anyway. Now I'm going to dry fit my fabric and get it, you know, kind of in a position where I think it would look best. Obviously before you get started, polycrylic is a bit noxious. So you should always do this in a well ventilated area. So either outside or in your garage with the garage door open. Because you'll get high and then, well, it's not healthy. So I'm just gonna pop this open with a flathead screwdriver. very carefully. <laughs> now the reason why we use uh, this Minwax water-based polycrylic is because it dries fast, which is great. So we're going to apply a thin coat to the top of the tabletop because this is going to act like a glue. already starting to dry so you can't use too much of this there we go okay now that I got this all covered oh. now if I can get Terry to help me with with the one end. I'm gonna start at one end here and give myself a little room and then gently place it on the tabletop. Good. I'm just gonna lay it flat and trim it. Trim it all around after I finish applying the varnish or polycrylic rather. So anyway, I've got this all nice and smoothed out. Now, kind of in the way of decoupage, I'm going to apply the polycrylic right on top of the fabric. Use copious amounts. They say liberal, apply liberally. This is obviously a project for adults or maybe teenagers with some adult supervision, but definitely not for little ones. Now you could choose a fabric that goes with your decor, like upholstery fabric, you know, that coordinates with your couch or your curtains. And it'll be very unique to you. You can't buy this. You can't buy this. 
So I've got the first coat of uh, polycrylic drying. I'm going to trim along the edge of the table because I don't need this excess fabric here. So now I've got my, all my edges trimmed off. Don't worry about it being uneven because I think um, you can go back with an X-Acto knife after this is completely dry and, and really get a straight uh, edge with the X-Acto knife. So we're just going to apply multiple layers of the polycrylic, letting them dry in between coats, and then you'll have a nice, smooth, shiny, tabletop. So I'm going to let this dry and throughout the week I'm going to uh, uh, keep applying layers of polycrylic so I can get a nice even top coat and perhaps next week I'll let you see the finished product. So thank you for watching. If you like a list of materials, check the description down below. So if you'd like to give this project a try, Take a picture of it and share it with me on Twitter. So again, thanks for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. Make a comment and subscribe if you haven't yet. Bye. You're a dork. I'm not a dork, you're a dork. <laughs>